results of a recent survey in which thousands of our customers responded indicated interest in the quiet car concept on the commuter rail. And we heard you. The quiet car makes for a much nicer, much nicer ride. I look for the quiet car every time I travel. I enjoy the quiet car ride every day. It's a peaceful, relaxing ride. I can do a lot of my work, or I can do nothing at all. It's just a real nice option to have. Hello, my name is Robert Huggin, Southside Train Master, and I'm here to tell you about the Quiet Car. After testing out the Quiet Car pilot program on the Fitchburg and Franklin lines January 3rd, 2011, on peak hour trains for 90 days successfully, the MBTA is now rolling out the Quiet Car system-wide to all commuter rail lines during peak times only. Whenever a new program goes into effect, it is often followed by many questions. This informational video has been created to address some of your most frequently asked questions. Excuse me, sir, what's a quiet car? It's a coach that is located closest to the locomotive on every train where passengers can enjoy a peaceful and quiet ride to their destination with minimum noise interference. This service is appreciated by many of our customers, especially before a busy day and after a hectic one. The Quiet Car is a coach where customers are asked to refrain from cell phone use, keep pages, cell phones, laptops, PDA sounds off, and to speak quietly. Conductors will, of course, lift the Quiet Car restriction in time of disruption and overcrowding. We remind all of our customers that seating in the quiet car is on a first come first serve basis and the conductors cannot extend this service to a second car. I boarded the quiet car by mistake, what should I do? Don't worry, conductors checking tickets will remind customers that they are sitting in the quiet car. If you do not intend to sit in the quiet car, please feel free to go any other car or set your cell phones on vibrate and enjoy some peace and quiet. What if I make or receive a very important phone call? The answer to that question is to kindly relocate to another car if you must make or take an incoming call. If you must leave your cell phone on, switch it to vibrate function so that its ring won't disturb others. Can you chat with fellow riders if you whisper? Yes, but please keep your tone to a whisper. If you need to speak at a whisper the entire ride, it might make more sense to ride in a non-quiet car. Can announcements be disabled in a quiet car? We want to preserve a quiet atmosphere for the comfort of our riders. However, we must make all required onboard announcements. What if another rider is too loud? Please keep in mind, quiet does not mean total silence. A certain amount of tolerance to noise is necessary. If needed, it is acceptable to politely remind your fellow rider that they are riding in a quiet car. Please know that crew members are often performing duties necessary to operate a safe and on-time trip and may be available to address quiet car rules. Most importantly, the quiet car is an amenity for our passengers and is expected to be maintained purely by mutual respect for one another. I hope this provides you with useful information and your questions have been answered. So please, on behalf of the MBTA and MBCR, relax and enjoy the ride.